In this episode, we're going to take a look at a promotion for a new game that Matt put out this morning. It's going to be run in conjunction with Splinterlands. It's going to burn SPS and DEC. Can you say, oh yeah, brother? Hey, all you Splinterheads. Or should I say wrestling fans? Thanks for dropping by. This is Bronze Dragon bringing you some news on a new promotion that Matt put the information out this morning uh, that will run in conjunction with Splinterlands. Okay? Uh, we've seen a few of these promotions come out up, and they, they don't really require any work from the Splinterlands team, but it is other companies and other games on the high blockchain which are working in conjunction and usually end up uh, kind of helping out Splinterlands uh, or the tokenomics. So let's go ahead and uh, dive right into it. If you like this kind of content, please go ahead and like and subscribe. I do really appreciate it. Um, okay, so early this morning, and for some reason I didn't see this until after lunch, but Matt put out a, an official announcement on Discord. And uh, he said, uh, I'm not going to read through this whole thing, but uh, a quick ping today to let you know that the SPS DEC burning promotion hosted by our good friends at the wrestling organization online, woo, both Aggie and I have helped advise and lend support to Hive's wrestling themed auto battler over the years, and we're excited to see them uh, on the cusp of a full release. Okay, so they're getting ready to release this new uh, game called Woo, which I, I've seen, uh, see, I've looked at it uh, a few times over the last year or two. Uh, I've never dove into it because it seems like it's just been making steady progress, right? Uh, it's interesting. Um, I'm not, I wouldn't describe myself as a huge wrestling fan, um, but at this point in time, I'm just looking for something interesting and fun to do on Hive, really. So uh, that's what caught my eye. So, Starting June 21st, which is today, if you buy a booker's license, which is their kind of terminology similar to uh, the spell book in, in Splinterlands, uh, using SPS or DEC, you will get a free NFT starter pack. And the SPS or DEC is going to be completely burned. So once again, another promotion from another game that will help out SPS and DEC. Okay. There's two different layer, levels of these starter packs depending upon when you got in on it. The first 50 are rare and uh, the uh, other 150 are going to be common. Uh, as soon as I saw this message after lunch, I went ahead and bought my, uh, what is it called? It is called Booker's License. Um, I had to remember that. But as, as soon as I saw it, I bought my Booker's License. I don't hold much help in hope in getting the rare package because it was several hours in between um, but uh, he leaves the link uh, to go ahead and get the booker's license which is played out wrestling organization online that is a long url uh, they really need to shorten that up it needs to be like playwoo.com or playwooonline.com anyway you go to the website and you can buy it uh, and you can it gives you a selection you can buy it with a variety of different uh, tokens on the hive engine uh, but if you use SPS or DEC then uh, it will be completely burnt now um, then the second step you have to do is you have to go and you have to join the woo discord and then you have to put in a ticket okay just like you're doing like a support ticket there's just a button to push and then in the ticket uh list your hive engine name and just say hey i'm i'm looking to uh pick up the promotional package and basically what that's going to do is give you some starter cards to start working with okay so let's go ahead and and then it leaves a link to this uh, peak d article which fully describes uh, so the first season is three months and they're calling it the summer of woo June 21st to September 21st. And they've got a lot of different uh, uh, events planned. Uh, so we're going to just take the uh, short version of this. Uh, once again, as always, I will leave the link to the Peak D article in the show notes in case you want to go ahead and check it out. But uh, the shortened, uh, the Reader's Digest short version of this is dozens of contests with at least 1,500 hive up for grabs, bonus prizing of another 1,500 hive. So that's 3,000 hive and all. Uh, Splinterlands Partnership, new users can buy the Booker's License with SPS or DEC, and those will be burnt, like we just talked about. 
Um, they're going to burn a bunch of the Woo tokens um, and enter Woo raffles for a chance to win some exclusive signed wrestler partner memorabilia, NFTs, Woo tokens, and other awesome stuff. Now, um, once again, you can go and read about this stuff. I'll leave the link. But um, I kind of wanted to wait to do this video until I actually got my starter pack, but I didn't get it yet. And I understand that uh, we'll go over to the main page here. This is what happens when you log in um, and uh, you can see that I already bought, but if you wanna go ahead and buy your Booker's license, just click on that. And you have to have your tokens available on Hive Engine to go ahead and purchase it. It's 10 bucks worth uh, of either SPS or DEC if you wanna get in on this. Um, it's kind of a very familiar uh, UI uh, as far as getting around to your cards. You can go into your collection, you can go into, uh, under collection you can go you have different sections talent land lore and items and uh, as we go along i'll be doing other videos and updating as i learn more about the game uh, but the, then you can go into the marketplace and buy your various cards uh, your different people different land uh, different items and this game is going to shape up to be pretty interesting at least to me because the land game is going to be completely different than what Splinter Lands because the land is kind of uh, sectioned off as a place where you're actually going to have wrestling events okay the idea behind this game is you have this um, traveling show which is basically what a wrestling event is and you're the person putting it together you have to hire your people uh, you have to come up with the moves they're going to use you have your managers and there's there's a lot of other stuff to it. I've just barely scratched the surface. I will also put the link to the white paper uh, in the show notes as well so you can read about it if you're interested because you can see that the different uh, functions on the cards are the cost, speed, damage, health, rarity, uh, and um, they the rarity is like either common or uh, or rare, which is going to be silver or gold is the way they terminology. It's kind of like the difference between a, a regular foil and a gold foil. But then you can see they have a number of different moves. They have the managers affecting everything. Um, they have uh, a different part of the game, which is the uh, match types and the land and where you're going to host the actual shows. So there's a lot to this. It's There's a lot more right up front than just that auto battler between two wrestling people. So that's what kind of what... Uh, interested me so so basically this was just a heads up video to let you know that's happening uh as matt put that information out this morning so i'm jumping in uh, i don't know how deep i'm gonna go but it sounds interesting so why not uh at least it makes good uh youtube video so uh sounds fun to me so let me know in the comments what you think of the idea in the promotion are you going to take part in it Either way, I hope everyone on your side is happy and healthy, and it's just going into the weekend here, so everybody be safe. I'll see you on the flip side.